Sixth grade, module one, lesson 29, problem set. Number one. Henry has 15 lawns mowed out of a total of 60 lawns. What percent of the lawns does Henry still have to mow? So for number one, he has 15 mowed out of 60. We want to know what percent does he still have to mow. So remember, percents are out of 100. So we want to find a way to make this an equivalent fraction. Now, 15 60ths, I can't easily get that to 100, but I can divide both 15 and 60 by 5 or even 15, but I'm just going to divide them by 5. So 15 divided by 5 is 3, and 60 divided by 5 is 12. So I still can't get to 100 easily, but I'm going to divide them by 3 again. So I'm just going to keep reducing until I find something that I can multiply and get to 100. So 12 divided by 3 is 4, so that's equal to 1 fourth. And I can multiply 4 times 25 to get 100. So 25 out of 100 is equal to 25%. So Henry has mowed 25%. We want to know what does he still have to mow. So let's do 100 minus 25%. He still has 75% to mow. Number 2. Marissa got an 85% on her math quiz. She had 34 questions correct. How many questions were on the quiz? So 85% would mean 85 out of 100. And she had 34 questions correct out of, we don't know the total number of questions, but we know she got 34 correct, which was equal to 85%. So again, I need to figure out how to get from 85 to 34. But I can't do that, so I'm going to start by reducing. Now since this ends in a 0 and a 5, I know I can divide them both by 5. So 100 divided by 5, I know, is 20. And 85 divided by 5 is 17. And then to get from 17 to 34, I can do that by multiplying by 2. So all I have to do is multiply 20 by 2 and get 40. So there were... 40 questions on the quiz. And then the last one, number three. Lucas read 30% of his book containing 40, 480 pages. What page is he going to read next? So he's read 30%, 30 out of 100. And then the book has a total number of 480 pages. So we want to know how many pages he's read and then what page he's going to read next. So I can't easily get there. So I'm going to make this 3 tenths. And now I can do 10 times 48 is equal to 480. So let's do 3 times 48. Four times three is 12, plus two is 14. So he's read 144 pages. The page he's going to read next would be page 145.